Cursor sharing and order by. Here's the question that came in. If cursor sharing equals force, means we take every single literal and replace it with a bind variable, well, this is someone you know starting to worry that that's going to be a bit of a drama, isn't it? Because what if I do order by one, one's a literal, order by two, two's a literal. If I replace them with a bind variable, then I'm going to get the same ex, you know, the same piece of SQL text. But obviously, these are fundamentally different SQL statements. Is are we going to have some dramas here? To clarify that that particular position, what you should do is check the docs because the docs covers this particular scenario explicitly. If you look in the docs, it says. If a statement uses an order by clause, the database does not perform literal replacement because it is not semantically correct to do so. You'll be pleased to know the people inside you know, the kernel team, they thought about this and it says in the docs, we will not do that. At which point you think that's the end of this question, right? We're done. Part two is don't check the docs. And let's see why you shouldn't check the docs on this particular circumstance. I'm going to set cursor sharing equals force. Therefore, all literals will be replaced with bind variables. But as per the docs, order by statements will not. So we'll turn feedback on. We'll set the SQL ID so we know what the SQL ID is. If you haven't seen that, that's in SQL plus 18 and above. Uh, you can get the SQL ID for the statement just run. Let's do select star from scott.emp where employee number greater than zero, order by two, order by the employee name. The SQL ID is 19M something something. Just remember it's 19M. We'll reference that later. Let's have a look at what, SQL, what cursor sharing has done. As per the docs, it will not touch the order by statement. If we have a look, it very much did touch the order by statement. It replaced all the literals with bind variables, including the one after the order by. So the docs are wrong. That's why I said in this particular circumstance, don't trust the docs. So what happens if we throw another SQL statement at it now with order by one? It's identical, except it's not order by two, it's order by one, which is order by the employee number. Two different SQL statements. If we go look at v.sql, the same SQL statement got replaced, literals got replaced. But one thing that gives us hope is that there are now two children, two separate cursors for this same parent SQL statement cursor. Why would we have two cursors in there? Even though we did replace the literal with a bind variable, the database was intelligent enough to know that this was not the same SQL statement. They can't simply be trusted to use the identical plans, etc. They are fundamentally different. If we go look up, if I scroll back a bit here, this is why we needed to remember that SQL statement, the 19M. If we go look at v SQL shared cursor, which is the view we use to work out why two children could not be formed, you know, used, treated as one, we scroll down, we see the one that gets set to Y, if I can find it, is this one. Hash match failed. And that's the critical one. This is simply saying that we could not share these statements, even though the SQL text, once it had been bindized or turned into bind variables, even though that ended up with the exact SQL text, we could not share them due to hash match failed. So what's hash match failed? If we go look in the docs for that, it says, no existing child cursors have unsafe literal bind hash values required by the current cursor. And the key word there is unsafe. It would be unsafe to treat those two SQL statements as the same. A doc bug has been logged. So unfortunately, it's just probably bad semantics. The docs really with their intention was saying, yes, there is no way we're going to share that, that SQL statement. But the reality is we do actually go grab that literal in the order by and we do replace it with a bind variable. But we're smart enough to know that these are still two different cursors, even though they had the same SQL text now. So we're not going to get wrong results. You're not going to get bad execution plans, but the docs do need to be corrected.